hello guys welcome back to my channel it's been a really 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 long time ago uh, since I've been here but uh, it's just because of a personal engagement so I've not been able to find a time to come around to share what I have for you concerning the education of um, Estonia and most especially what I promised to discuss, that is the scholarships that are available for PhD students. Yeah, so I'm going to uh, do that today. Of course, another thing that delayed this video was that I've been trying to find a better way or the best way to present the scholarship to you because the scholarship is a whole lot there are PhD scholarship, there are different type of scholarship, but I want to talk about the PhD scholarship basically. So I decided that uh, I'm going to display it. You understand? Like after this video, you might not see my face, you will only be seeing the uh, screen display of my laptop. Uh, this, uh, so I'm going to be showing you because. I was able to uh, arrange the PhD program and all the information that you will need on a Excel sheet. So I'm going to be displaying that to you in a moment. So you'll be able to check it and if you want to check the details, the emails are there, the contact persons are there, the phone numbers as well are there. So. You, if you need to contact them or if you need to find out more information about the scholarships, then you can do that on your own. But I will be displaying the scholarship to you and the information that you might need about the scholarship. So, yeah, uh, let's get started. See you in the screen display. Thank you. All right, guys, like I said. I was going to display the information that I have for you through my computer screen so that I could be able to catch up with the explanation of uh, so many of those scholarships. Of course, this is not all the scholarships, but uh, there are so many of them. Uh, but today, I'm going to be sharing this few scholarships as relates to PhD. Of course, some of them are also for uh, bachelor's degree and master's degree and PhD all together. So uh, let's just uh, get started. Uh, scholarship for students with special needs will be the first one I'm going to talk about. So uh, the founder of this scholarship is uh, Acmate Foundation. The category it belongs to is a scholarship so uh, and then the target are the bachelor's degree master's degree and phd degree students so you can check the link i'm going to be displaying this link on the information uh, section of my youtube uh, video so i will display all these links there so if you want to get more specific information or more detailed information then you can go to the links i'm going to be putting the links so i just want to show you so that uh, you can understand so we have a doctoral allowance uh, this is funded by the university of tartu and the category it belongs to is the allowance is only for phd students so then we have doctoral stipend smart specialization uh, it's funded by the University of Tartu. It's a stipend and uh, it's only for PhD students as well. Then we have Estonian governmental scholarships for International Bachelor's Acmate Foundation allowance. It's an allowance and it's for all the levels of education, bachelor's degree, master's degree and PhD degree. Then we have Dura Plus sub sub action 1.1 this is a short-term mobility uh, it is uh, funded by the acme foundation and uh, uh, it is issued for just uh, 30 days so it's a 30 days grant 
uh, is, because it's a short-term mobility. It's available for uh, master's degree and PhD degree. And then we have the plus sub, sub action 1.2 doctoral student mobility for University of Tartu students. Uh, it is uh, Acme Foundation that funded it, and it's a mobility grant for up to ten months only for PhD students. Then we do we have Esto Philos Scholarship, also funded by Ahmed Foundation. Uh, it's a research grant for international master's degree, PhD, conduct research in Estonia. And you understand? So, uh, like I said, the links are going to be displayed in the information section on the YouTube page. And then we have uh, scholarships for international students. Uh, it is also by Acme Foundation. And it's a scholarship and mobility grant. That it's available for master's students, bachelor's degree students, and PhD students. Uh, it's particularly uh, in summer. It's for participation in summer uh, you know, there is usually this summer school, if you want to go to summer school, so you can actually apply for this scholarship if you want to go to summer school. Uh, my school has been sending me some inf information about wanting me to come and do a summer school, but uh, during summer, I'm usually very, very busy working or probably it should be my vacation period, so I've not really been able to get my mind together to do a summer school but i think one of these days I, I will try to do a summer course something like that so then we have scholarships for researchers it's also funded by acme foundation and the category is scholarship is only for researchers and academic staff so if you are in this category then you can go for it then we have smart specialization scholarships for PhD students also funded by Acme Foundation is a scholarship PhD related to smart specialization, computer science and robotic. So these are the uh, courses that can apply for this particular type of uh, scholarship. Then we have Estonia National Contest for University Students. Uh, it's, it is funded by Estonia Research Council. The, I think it's a, for, it's a kind of a research contest. Probably they will come up with a particular topic and everybody will write about the topic and the, the best person is going to get the, the, the research grant. So all students that are studying in Estonia, including foreign students as well. So uh, I believe that it's going to be like a contest that they will finance you. They will give you a grant to do a specific uh, um, research. So yeah, so you can read more about it in the link. So I'll, I'll put the link on the on the information section. Uh, and then we have a Voldemar Yambag scholarship that is funded by the University of Tartu. It's a scholarship. Uh, social science master studies, doctoral studies, postdoctoral studies, research fellow and lecturer. Those are the categories of people that could apply for this particular scholarship. Then we have Christine Yak scholarship uh, or study period abroad. That is, uh, it is funded by Ahmed Foundation. So if you are a student of the of University of Tartu and you are going to um, uh, another school outside Estonia to do your study exchange. I think I've talked about the study exchange when I was talking about the scholarship that are available for bachelor's degree and master's degree. You can check the video to understand what it means to go for study exchange as a student of University of Tartu. So it is only available for master's and doctoral degree students. So you can read more about it in the link. I, I will put it in the details, like I said. And then the last one is Rai Fund Scholarship for International Students of the University of Tartu. 
So it is funded by University of Tartu with a scholarship. Uh, all the levels of education can apply for this, all the level up to PhD level can apply for this. So uh, it's, it's a scholarship that is for all. So you can read more about it here. So there are more, there are more, but I'm going to probably I'm going to do it like uh, uh, part one and part two. So, but for this time, this is all I have uh, to share this time. Because uh, the time is going already, and I don't want this video to be too long, so that it will be too, but it will not be too boring for people to watch. All right, so I will catch you in the part two of this particular video. So the reason why it was a little bit uh, late for me to make up my mind to do this video is because I'm, I was looking for a, the best way to give you this information. I think creating an Excel, you know, sheet to show you uh, specifically is the best way to go. Because if I won't give you all this information, the video will be too long. So, yeah. So, see you. Thank you. I hope you all enjoyed the information that i shared and i hope you were able to gain one or two things from it so if you like my video and the stuff that i'm doing please subscribe to my channel share with your friends so that they can also benefit from this opportunity and also subscribe uh, to my channel then uh, always click the notification bell so that you can be informed anytime that i post a new video also click like and as well you are welcome to comment so that i can give you probably the information that i might have, i might have missed during the video so thank you so much and see you next time